I want to take a minute to talk about sensitivity, specificity, positive predictive value, and negative predictive value. And in working out any of these problems, the first thing you need to do is to make a 2x2 two two square. And on the top of that square, you're going to write in reality. And on the left side of the square, you're going to write in test. You have positive, negative, positive, and negative. When you have a positive test and a positive reality, you're going to have a true positive. When you have a negative test and a negative reality, that's going to be a true negative. And when filling out the other two boxes, it's important to remember that the test is the most important aspect of those boxes. So when you have a negative test and a negative reality, that means that you're going to have a false negative. Because a negative, the uh, test is the most important. And for the positive test and the negative, rea and the negative reality, that means you're going to have a false positive. Because once again, the uh, test is the most important. Now, with sensitivity and specificity, you're going to be looking at the test. And with positive predictive value and negative predictive value, you're going to be looking at the person. And when I say that, as far as sensitivity, when the test is positive, what is the probability that the person has the disease? And that's what sensitivity is all about. Specificity is when the test is negative. What is the probability that the person does not have the disease? For positive predictive value, what is the probability that the person has the disease if the, te if the test is positive? For negative predictive value, what is the probability that the person does not have the disease if the test is negative. And in order to figure out sensitivity, sensitivity, you're going to take the true positives and divide that. You're actually going to go down. You're going to divide it by true positives plus false negatives. So it's basically sensitivity is true positives divided by true positive plus false, negative. And that's the equation for sensitivity. For specificity, you're going to take true negatives and you're going to go up. And it's going to be true negatives divided by true negatives plus false positives. So you're going to have true negatives divided by true negatives plus false positives. Now, for positive predictive value, that's going to be, you're actually going to go across with positive predictive value. And that's going to be true positives divided by true positives plus false positives. So that is true positives over true positives plus false positives. And that's the equation for positive predictive value. The equation for negative predictive value, you're going to go across in the opposite direction. And that's going to be true negatives divided by true negatives plus false negatives. And there is a mnemonic uh, that you can use as far as sensitivity and specificity and that's spin and snout, and uh, specificity is going to rule in, snout, sensitivity, that's going to rule out. So the test you want to rule out is going to be uh, sensitivity, and the test that you want to rule in, spin, is going to be specificity.